Hi, welcome to my analytics channel, especially to my dear colleagues out there who are keep on asking me right now on how did I make my learning content and the tools that I use. You know, creating a learning content is not easy because uh, you need to be good in speaking, but don't you worry about it as long as you know how to demonstrate your work then it's easy for you. Of course, you have to plan how do you present your learning materials, the transition, and the recording part. For me, I'm using the PowerPoint screen recording and Filmora application to integrate and finalize all of my video learning content. Then I will upload that in YouTube. Okay, so this is now your request. I'll be uh, showing you on how I executed my video learning content. Okay, this is what I did. All you have to do is to open a blank form PowerPoint presentation. Then you click your insert menu and find a screen recording icon. Then after that, you have to uh, proceed to your PowerPoint uh, presentation where your topic is placed. Then you have to select this area that you want to be part of your recorded presentation. Assuming this is your presentation, okay, uh, make sure that you have already clicked the record button to record your presentation. Then you may start uh, talking and discussing your presentation. Then after you do that, then you have to position your cursor at the top of the screen like this. Then click the X button or the close button. Then that recorded presentation will be automatically transferred to your PowerPoint presentation that you have opened. And after that, you can uh, select the slide, then save your presentation as media file like this. Okay, then you can name your media file and save it. Then after that, you will open your Filmora application. Actually, I bought this uh, Filmora application for almost 500 pesos a month. So all you have to do is to select new project. Now you are directed to your Filmora application. So this is your workspace. Okay, all you have to do if you want to uh, integrate a media file, just open your media file and drag to the Filmora workspace. All you have to do is to drag, okay, your media file here, like for example. Okay, so you have already dragged your media file. You can adjust your audio by clicking this part, double click. Then you can adjust your audio, okay? Then for you to review your media file, all you have to do is to click this play button and try to listen. Then if you think that there are some part of the media file, there are some issues, and you want to cut that part, all you have to do is to click, then uh, play it again. Then if you think that this is the last part, okay, uh, that you want to remove, you have to click on uh, this one. Okay, then select that part, then press the delete. Then you have to drag in, okay. So then after this, if you want to make a title, if you're going to insert a title before this, all you have to do is to select, just select that for you to move and for you to insert also the titles here. So, okay, then create the titles here. So you have the titles, we have here the openers if you want, if you want to use this one or this one, for example, this one. Okay, then you have to drag it here, then you click that one, then you can now edit that. Okay, so for example, that's programming. 
programming. Oh, sorry. Programming. Okay, this is your your demo. Your demo. Then just click C plus plus example. Then you can change that color if you want. Just click that text. Then choose the color that you want here. Okay. Then of course the font size. You can choose any font size here. The font styling here. Then there's another design here. Animation. If you want some animation of your text, like for example this one. Okay. So it will be applied to your selected uh, text area. That is how you then you play it here. Okay, that's the end. Then you can apply some. Okay, you can apply it and post this one. Then you can apply some transition if you want. Okay, select then move. And you can apply some transition here. So it depends upon you. Where do you apply transition? For example, because we are moving to the next okay presentation, you apply that one. It, it's up to you. Where do you apply that? Okay. So you can now play, try to check. Oh, that's the app. That's the application. Okay, there's a lot of transition here that you want to integrate in your presentation. Now, if you're going to um, add some titles here, all you have to do, click the titles, and you can choose any, uh, any text design. Okay, and then you can double click there. For example, programming again. Okay, at the top of your media file. And of course, for visibility purposes, okay, that one, then you can, you know, position that by dragging that text, okay, then change the color, then okay. So that's how you create your media file here and do some editing technique. And if you want to add more video files, all you have to do is to position this to here at the last part of your video file then you open your video files like this and drag it here like that okay so now you can combine your two video files here also you can add more video track because we have only one video track here all you have to do is to click this icon this is a manage track if you want to add a video track Okay, since you add a video track, then you can overlap this video to another video track, example, or another video file. Example here, okay, then it's overlapping video. Okay, that's how it is. And here we have the elements. You can incorporate this one. It's up to you. Okay, it's up to you on how you design. We have a lot of icons. All you have to do is to double click that and apply. Okay. Okay, it's up to you like that one. Okay, you can do some minimizing that one or maximizing the icon. It's up to you. Okay, so after you did all your editing, Okay, so if you finish already, then all you have to do is to click this export button. Okay, then of course you select which drive do you want to save your work. It's up to you. Then export and wait for the uh, Filmora to finish the uh, conversion to a video file. Okay, so there's actually there's a lot of format here. You can choose, okay, from this format that you want. Okay, then there's also um, if you want to um, use a YouTube format here, so you can choose that 1920 by 1080. 
static. That's it. Okay, this is how easy you use Fillmore application. Okay, thank you.